Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of It's All Relative. If you guys are here for the title, just the title part, I'm gonna reveal it right now. No one wants to like wait till the end of the video, right? And we got no time for that. So I was able to find not one, but two, two shiny Pokemon that are not even event related Pokemon, right? So what happened was that I was on my way home and I was able to click one Pokemon and bam, this is the shiny. The first one, it was a shiny pincer. It was amazing. I freaking love shiny pincer. I don't have a shiny pincer by the way. So when I saw it, I was like, boom, god damn man, I finally found one. <sighs> yeah. And then after that, just right after I caught the pincer, right, uh, I think I was on the bus or something, uh, Murkrow spawned right next to where the pincer spawned, and I clicked on it and BAM! Wait, but I just do this, it doesn't matter. We found a shiny Murkrow, which by the way, I do not even have a shiny Murkrow, so in the space of two minutes, and I'm not even joking, two minutes or one minute, I think it's one minute or something like that, I was able to find two shiny Pokemon that I don't even have from the start. Okay, so look here guys. We are able to find a shiny pincer, 700 CP. Uh, this guy looks beautiful, guys. I just, I just gotta say. And then a shiny Murkrow. Wow. Okay. So I, this is actually a few days ago uh, at the time of recording this right now. I actually took a snapshot, and I think I'm gonna put it right here or right here. Doesn't matter. You're gonna see that the difference between the first Pokemon, the shiny pincer, and the shiny Murkrow was caught between one minute and part. So I was not lying when I said that I caught two shiny Pokemon that are so next to each other. I think they were standing next to each other. Thank you, shiny Pokemon gods. What we're going to do right now in this episode after revealing those two Pokemon is that we're going to be getting our new research breakthrough uh, Pokemon which is going to be Forest Seed. Uh, I think that's how you pronounce it. With a lot of Stardust, we are going to be dropping a star piece. Uh, let's claim a couple of uh, quests here because I've been filling them up, you know. Alright, so Vulpix, is that a shiny? No. So, we have a Ferro Seed and I'm gonna catch it really quick and then see how much Stardust we get from this guy. Ooh, this Ferro Seed is not bad. We got 7,500 Stardust with, uh, uh, with the Star Piece, so I assume the base was 5,000 Stardust. Basically, I just wanted to show you guys that uh, after, I think the remaining of this episode, we're gonna be hunting for Thunders. Not today, obviously. I think tomorrow or few days later or something like that but thunderous is out for march uh as a new legendary pokemon for tier 5 so yeah we're going to be catching thunderous right after this okay guys it's a brand new day and look what we just found another shiny murkrow oh my god i swear to god i did not expect to get two shiny murkrow in one episode okay so here's the thing for today uh i mean it's a brand new day already uh since the last clip right we have like shiny dark ride around and also i haven't caught thunderous yet so maybe we'll try to get both of them but yeah getting a second shiny murkrow this is woohoo man there's gonna be shiny dark ride there's gonna be shiny scorapi scorapi then there's gonna be thunderous as well so hopefully we can get all three of them by the end of this episode Okay guys, I don't know what happened, but Singapore started to pour really heavily. Like it's raining, <clears throat> raining very heavily right now. Uh, I don't know, I'm walking towards a raid, but I don't know if I can get there because of the rain. Uh, we, we'll see, we'll see, because there's a lot of dark cry around and I really want to get some on the footage for you guys. So uh, in the meantime, there's like a Team Go Rocket kind of event going on. I'm doing it in the background, since so it's a bit boring and stuff, but the dark cry, that is what I want to show you guys. That was the wackiest rain I've ever encountered in Singapore in the longest time. This is crazy, man. But we have our first ever dark ride rain in a, one of the mall. I think it's Paragon Mall. Okay, I'm just gonna chill here in front of Jimmy Choo. Why not, right? My shoes are all wet. Holy crap, my shoes are all wet. Okay, we're gonna skip through the entire battle because we already seen a dark ride battle before. We just wanna see if it's shiny. That's all. Dark ride is down. Here we go, guys. Let's see if we can get a shiny for our first try for today. One, two. <laughs> no, it wasn't. This is 2089, definitely not 100%. Okay, we're gonna go for a second one. It's just right here. 
we are done with the second one. Here we go, guys. Let's see if we can get a shiny out of this. Oh, God. I'm quite, I'm quite nervous. Okay, I give up. Let's go find 2108. That's not 100%. Okay, let's go find a dark ride if we can around Orchard area. So yesterday was kind of a bust. I mean like it was raining, it was pouring and I couldn't really get to a lot of places to find a lot of dark ride and also well I was kind of in the middle of doing like the Team Go Rockets quest kind of thing. Didn't really get any shiny so I didn't really record too much for you guys. Uh, right now uh, I know my camera is a little bit tilted that's because I didn't bring my tripod but we actually have a thunderous. I wasn't expecting a thunderous. Uh, today is new. It's a brand new day already. I was looking for dark ride so that I can show you guys more possibility of finding a shiny dark ride but we have a thunderous here which we have not shown on this episode. So with that said we are going to, oops, sorry, with that said we're going to be fighting a thunderous for the first time ever and hopefully you can catch it on our first try as well but uh, I'm going to keep looking for more dark ride uh, before we end this episode because obviously I want that shiny dark right guys yeah so the problem is that right now all tier 5 eggs you have a possibility of getting a thunderous or a dark right so uh, it's kind of sucky that on this one weekend and stuff uh, you still need to be able to see you can get 50 50 percent I'm just hoping that usually when they come out this kind of releases of shiny right they would like how you say completely exclude the other Pokemon and then just focus on that shiny Pokemon for just that weekend Anyway, uh, if I haven't, if I didn't get a shiny in the end of this episode, let me know if you guys managed to find a shiny dark ride. And if you do, how many do you have? Okay, it's getting too sunny. I'm gonna walk to a shade or something. I don't know what's the max CP for this guy, but we're gonna find out. One eight nine nine. Is that good? I'm not sure. I only have eight. Oh god, that's not good. Come on. Yes, we got it, and it's too dark for you guys to see me, but we caught our first ever thunderous that is amazing. Look at that, guys. Pokedex entry. I knew I would get it for you guys, like, but it's not that great. Uh, 1899, I assume it's... Whoa, I was wrong. 96% thunderous is our first one. God, guys, that is quite good. 96% Anyway, there's actually a dark right here with like 7 minutes to go uh, Let me go check it out If there's nobody, I'm just going to go get some breakfast And hopefully we'll look for more dark right after this So we managed to find a dark right raid uh, Actually, right now my camera is kind of in a very very awkward slanted position So I'm making sure that it doesn't fall off But we actually have like about four different tier 5 eggs here. Uh, I think one, this one is a dark ride. There's three more going to hatch but I think we'll most likely only be able to catch like three of them because the other one's a bit far away. Okay Mr. Dark Ride, you are dead. Let's see. Can we, give me a 2 one something. 2 zero, nine, nine. Not that great. Okay, so let's see which we get. A shiny. Alright, here we go guys. One, two. No, oh, that's not it. 2099. Okay, at least we caught it. Alright, like I said, uh, there's one tier 5 egg over there, uh, 42 minutes. There's one right here, 27 minutes, another one at 48 minutes, so three more to go. Uh, you see, between this one and this one here, they're a little bit far apart-ish, so I think we're just going to tackle these two. Good thing it's a dark ride because we are here at our next raid. You know, I was a bit worried that it was going to be a thunderous, but thank god, thank god it's a dark ride. Um, after this, there's going to be one more raid. Uh, I'm not going to go for the other one, so total, after this one, there's one more. And then we're going to call it a day. Come on, give me that 2 one something. 2 one something. Okay, not bad. We're getting good IVs here. Uh, it's not the best, but... Damn it. <sighs> Got it. If I, cannot get a hun uh, if I cannot get a shiny, at least give me a hundo, because number one, Darkrai, you want to use it for your dark type Pokemon. It's the number one dark attacker, so definitely collect as many as you can. One of my friends actually got 200% and one shiny, so yeah, that person's luck, it's really good. All right, guys, I, you, I don't know if you guys can tell, but I am really sweaty right now. It's really hot today, it's really humid. Uh, well, Singapore weather, you, you know how it goes. Moment of truth, guys, moment of truth. Let's see if we can get, give me 2-1 something good. 2-1-1-6, that's much better than what I had before. Okay, can I get a shiny out of this one though? One and a two. <laughs> 2110. It's okay, it's 15 attack. I'll take it. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. Let me know what you guys want to see in the next episode and how many dark rides did you get that is shiny or hundo. Let me know in the comment section down below. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care, guys. Anyway, so yes, I was able to find not one, but not. Pfft.